Welcome to the Escape Module User Interface. Do you wish to initiate the evacuation tutorial? Negative. Hey, open this door. Let us in. Please let us in. Let us in. We're stuck out here. The system advises you wait and allow more personnel to board the escaped craft. Override system recommendation. The escape module has detached from the cruiser and will be out of the ship's blast radius in a moment. Are we safe now? You're part of the kitchen staff. You're a soldier. So are we safe? We're safe. Peter, what's our situation? The cruiser has been destroyed. We were able to escape the immediate blast zone. However, the power generator and life supports on this module were damaged by debris from the blast. What's the extent of the damage? The system regrets to inform you that there is less than 10 minutes left until the oxygen reserves are depleted and all power is lost. Did you say something about damage to the pod? Yeah, the computer said... The computer said that we were rocked by the concussion, but we'll be fine now. So, what's your name, soldier? ID number RD2364. Okay, number RD2364. Where are you from? I was stationed on Kalondai before being shipped out to patrol this sector. I... I meant more like your home. I was born and raised on Ares 7. The warrior planet. Sounds like someone had a great childhood. survived. Could have been worse. So, you're a soldier for life, then? Yep, from the womb to the tomb. How long you been in the fight? It's been five years since my first deployment. Where else have you been stationed? I was stationed on Solaris during the revolution. What was that like? Fire! It was war. So, what are you doing? I'm trying to open up a comm channel with our installation on Tantus 4, but their lines are full. Hey, can you hand me that tool? Thanks. So, I've told you my story. What's yours? I uh, signed up for the military to help save lives. Now I work in the kitchens. That's the whole of it. Beginning, middle, likely end. All right, all we can do now is wait for them to call back. Well, there's no rush there. They'll pick us up once they can and that'll be that.
So why'd you sign up? It's not like we're starved for troops. My parents died in a bombing when I was a kid. I would have died too if a Marine on leave hadn't pulled me out of the rubble. I was passing out in his arms and I looked up at him. There wasn't a scratch on him. There was dust everywhere, but not a speck on his uniform. He was a hero. There are no heroes, only those who act. What? It's something they taught us in Ares 7. I'm sorry, please continue. Okay, so, yeah, I signed up as soon as I was old enough. Wanted to save lives. But we didn't do much of that, so I transferred to the kitchens. Now I'm three and a half years into a five-year contract, and I've only left the ship twice. Once to pick up supplies on Saturn's moons. And the other time? Right now. Calling evacuation module CI-3917. This is communication. This is Soldier RD-2364. I'm on evac module CI-3917. Are you able to send help at this time? It's good to hear from you, RD-2364. How many are aboard your module? Just myself and a member of the ship's kitchen staff. According to protocol, your status requires you to be picked up by the second wave of relief ships. Estimated time of arrival is 17 minutes, as of the latest reports. Sir, I'm afraid that's not going to cut it. I'm afraid that's the best we can do for you, RD-2364. Our status requires... We know of your status, 2364. Your module will be deprived of oxygen soon. We apologize, but the number and rank of personnel aboard do not warrant retrieval from the first wave of relief craft. This isn't- However, on board your ship is a reserve oxygen tank and breathing apparatus. It will last you 20 minutes. Only 10 if you share it. Protocol states that as the highest ranking member of your module's crew, you take priority. The retrieval team is on their way. Have faith. You will live to fight another day, soldier. What did he say? Are they sending someone to come get us? Retrieval craft will be here in 15 minutes. <laughs> well, all right. That's what I want to hear. Would have been sooner if there was more personnel on board. <laughs> I'm not in any hurry. This is the first vacation I've had since signing up for this job. What's wrong with you? You look like someone just told you your dog died. Warning. Two minutes remaining until the oxygen reserves are depleted. What is that? What does it mean? It means this escape pod won't be able to sustain life for much longer. Are we gonna die? No. You'll live. Now listen, when there's 30 seconds of air left in this pod, the lights are gonna turn red. When that happens, put on this mask and start the flow of oxygen. When the oxygen is completely gone, the lights will turn off. One minute until the retrieval team should be here soon, so you should have enough air to last you until then. No, I can't. You're the military personnel. Isn't your life the priority? Not anymore. But what about you? Consider it in order. So what's your name anyways? I feel like if I'm gonna save your life, I deserve to know. My name is Alex. Well, Alex, it's nice meeting you. How about you? What's your name? I don't ever remember having one.
Sarah. 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 